as humans, we're really interested in something we have the power to change the form of, from bubble gum to caramel to something that's really solid. And that's something that exists within glass blowing. Glass being something that is an object that we consume things through for a lot of the day. We have touch screens and desktop screens. People were kind of watching satisfying Instagram videos of people playing with slime and kinetic sand and getting something out of it that was tactile, but they weren't really getting the entire experience out of it as a sensorial human. I've been working on making a interactive object using glass that has conductive qualities to it. You've got the graphics that are going to respond to your fingertips and almost create liquid ripples. And then you've got this curve of the glass and they're going to be mapped to each other. It has never been done sculpturally with a curved object. I really like the idea of it becoming an educational tool or even helping people who are possibly disabled or have special needs and kind of want something that's very sensorially engaging. A lot of people say about my work uh, that it makes them want to lick the screen. People say, I wish I could just reach out and grab it. So I really wanted to almost break that seal and burst that bubble of what we think of as an interface.